Reggie Showers. I am a two-time world motorcycle drag racing champion. And the win goes to Reggie Showers. Snowboard instructor, certified, just all around adventurous guy. Drag racing a uh, pro stock motorcycle is by far the most amazing feeling on the planet, bar none. When you let the clutch go at the starting line, it's like time stops. Tools of the trade, I got my helmet, I got my gloves, I got my jacket, and I got my feet. We have to develop our products so that they can withstand just about any type of abuse. But when somebody like Reggie Showers wears our products, we really have to make sure that that product is there for him when they're doing these different activities. So every product goes through impact testing as well as cycle testing so that we provide a very strong, durable product, but also it has to perform. I was 14 years old and I used to ride my dirt bike after school. And this one particular playground that we had was adjacent to a train yard. I ventured out onto the train tracks to play on top of one of the boxcars. And I didn't realize the, uh, the danger that lurked in the power wire that stretched over top of the boxcars. I just got a little too close to it and the electricity reached out and arced onto me. The heat from the electricity exiting just killed all the muscles and tendons in my feet so they had to amputate both below the knees. I can't really tell you why this never stopped me. It's, it's just this burning passion inside of me. I grew up with a lot of mentors in my life, so I'm paying it forward. I like to give back, so um, that's me. One of the big challenges we have is the diversity in our patient population. Every person is different from every other person. They weigh different amounts, they're different heights, they're different amputation levels, they are involved in different activities, and we have to account for that in our designs. So our designs are extremely flexible. One of the things that we do here at College Park is when we get an order, it comes in with a bill of materials that's customized to each patient. Right here in our, our final assembly area, there's over 4,800 different pieces. So the customization options can be endless. For our True Step product alone, there's over 460,000 combinations of different uh, firmnesses, stiffnesses, composites that can actually be built. Engineering design excellence is at the key of everything we do here at College Park. PTC products, especially Creo, have allowed us to quickly take a design concept to the market so we can run past different ideas and concepts very quickly through the initial concept phase, which gets us right into the engineering phase for product development. I'm just a, a patient, uh, a consumer, and I don't know a lot about um, engineering, but all I've ever seen come out of College Park is their feet just keep getting better. I just tried out the new soleus foot from College Park and I can tell you from the day that I stepped in it, I jumped, I ran, and it was this whole new world that opened up to me that takes, I didn't even know existed. With the help of PTC Creo, we've been able to introduce three new product lines with over the past three years, which is an aggressive timeline. Using Creo Simulate, we are able to impart loads on a design. The Simulate software is able to predict stresses and strains within the parts that we have designed. That's a very powerful tool. Without that tool, you're adding many months to the design timeline. You actually have to physically build and test these parts on actual patients. But by simulating it using the Creo software, we are able to cut a lot of that out of the equation. We're very lucky to be able to touch people's lives directly. We hear back from the field on a regular basis about the lives that we've impacted and things we've been able to do for people. My hat's off to all the engineers, everybody involved with building a foot like that. It's really important that I show love and respect to people who have dedicated their lives into building these, these feet that allows me to go out and live a better life. The extreme sports, the, uh, the mentoring to the younger generation, um, so it's a it's a collective effort.